Hi guys, welcome back again to another YouTube Vlog TV. Today news is we are still on the and the matter of Fedi Cloland and the um, Peggy Ohiri uh, traditional wedding they did yesterday, the 19th of November 2022. My people, big congratulations to my people. You guys are so amazing, so wonderful. Ah, I'm so happy for you guys. More especially, Frederick, I'm happy for you. I love your movie. I love everything about it. Although I don't know Peggy very well. I don't know her very well. But I know you, Frederick. So, and I'll do be your, one of your fans. So, I love you. I wish you very well. I wish both of you happy wedlock, happy marriage life. I, my people, ah, <laughs> this video will make you, 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 make you go emotional because I will leave, you will see a place where we say, Pe uh, Peggy, after, during the, the traditional wedding, and they will see where Peggy have been advising women to have patience in their, in relationship to just, sure, she was praising her mom, you know, making us to understand that Frederick is the right man for her. He's a good man. He's a is a in fact he's a God fearing man. He's a he's a caring man. He's a lovely man. It's everything every woman wishes to have as a man. It's everything. So he has all the quality. Quality. So she she's like a present the husband during the traditional wedding of yesterday, being 19 November 2022. So my people, if you go to the internet now, you guys know that is what is trading all over social media now and i believe that if you see this video you don't wish her well meaning that you don't like good thing because it is a good thing to find a good wife and you know bible says he who find a good life find a good thing and you know when a man is not married and the woman is not married they are up to age and they are not yet married you know that there is something lack on their life so when they get to get her gets and they meet their partner so what do we do to wish them well, happy wedlock and happy marriage and pray for them that God Almighty will continue to bless their union, to bless them, bless them with everything that you used to bless every marriage couple. So they are, they are the latest couple in the town and here you see a video where Peggy was crying, shedding tears emotionally because uh, her father blessed her and hugged her. And if you look at the, the first clip of video you watch before I start talking, narrating what is, is going on here and what is happening yesterday. And you see where the father kissed her and blessed her. And she was like, eh? she she felt cried. She cried, you know. It, you know, guys know, if you're a married person that are here watching the video, you know what I'm talking about. It's not easy to leave a home, your own home, and move to another man's home. And start answering that person's name automatically because of the name of marriage. So his parents is, is take us a tear of joy and emotional feeling. Because if you remember the old in the time you are little with your brothers and sisters, cousin, friends, where we share families and your father, your your parents, uh, you know. So when you remember all this, you will see that the tear of joy and emotional feeling will come to you. So that is what Peggy, Peggy, Peggy O'Hiri, what she was doing during the time her father was blessing her, hugging her and praying for her. So guys, so this is what is going on right now in social media. So if you have a good heart, and you're a fan of uh, Frederick, even if you are not a fan of Frederick or Perry or Kihiri, please make you wish them well. And don't forget to drop your comments in comment section what you wish them. Because whatever you wish somebody, that is what is that is what is going to come to you back. That is the reason why we need to wish them happy marriage, happy traditional wedding marriage. Because I know that very soon they are going to do their church word which we are will still come and bring it to you so that you know what is happening in the social media internet space so my people that is what happened and they can see them they are happy they're happy married 
and they, 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 when they talk about the pains they go through, and more especially uh, uh, Peggy O'Hiri was narrating, I will, when the time I will leave you to watch what Peggy was saying here concerning her man that got married, just really got married yesterday. Now she is official married to Frederick Lollard, you know. So, you know, a lot of uh, there is an interview I watched during the, the time they interview Frederick. Frederick they say that people thought that he is not an Igbo man. So if you are not an Nigerian person, Igbo, Igbo uh, what I, thought I mean by Igbo man is the part of the uh, Eastern region or in Nigeria. So we they call them Igbo. So that is where the Frederick come from, where the wife come from, data states. They are also part of Igbo Union, you know, region. So my people. So people like wonder even when they are doing their engagement and all people like say ah before they are friend but they don't know whether this is going to be real or just you know but it is a very is a very very real right now I can see it happening live and direct where the wedding is taking place where the woman is she is confessing and professor you know confessing how Frederick is called man how you need to be strong in your your relation and they she also encouraging the women out there that are not yet married to pick courage and uh, play a good role as a woman in your relation relationship and uh, in your marriage as well so that is what peggy had been telling us here so my people i think uh, i will leave you guys but before i go i will not like to leave you without saluting you i welcome you all uh, here and for my results uh, subscriber thank you so much for always tuning on and watch my video for my new if you are new here don't forget to subscribe my name is Ada DJ blog TV God bless you massive and I don't take your love for granted I love you massive and God bless you I will see you again in my next update God bless keep watching and keep on your bell notification so that you'll be of the will be the first person also to notify whenever I upload a, a new update. God bless you. See you. Bye. I have always been a hardworking woman. All my friends know. You you understand. Um, but when I met Frederick, I saw a man that was willing to to make money. I saw a man that is not a womanizer. And most importantly, that is why I stayed for this long, babe. Please don't change. No. Frederick is one man I can beat my chest on, despite what everyone is saying, that he doesn't womanize. <laughs> Sometimes I get on his nerves and he thinks that I'm taking him for granted. Maybe I'm not. I'm just a woman. We can be silly sometimes. <laughs> but I will love you. I will respect you. You will always be the crown on my head. You will be the man I ask for decisions before I make it. To everybody that you have fought my case for, God will fight your case for you. Thank you for waking up in the morning and say, babe, let's pray. Frederick, as much as you look good, you make me want to love God the more. Frederick doesn't stop praying. Sometimes I feel bad that I don't pray enough. <laughs> Frederick wakes up in the morning, he prays. He wakes up at night, he's praying. And I said, this is a good man. And when I met Frederick, smart him, he had a girlfriend. <laughs> But then I looked at his future and I said, this guy is going to make it. Peggy, stay. And to tomorrow, Frederick asked me, how did you know that I will get here? So to everybody, every young lady out there, if you have a guy that you like, you love him, he doesn't have money, please stay. Listen to him. 
encourage him. That is all that I have done on these years. It got, to, it got to a point I thought that Frederick would not marry me. I'm like, Frederick, I'm a fine girl. You're wasting my time. <laughs> and he'll be like, wait, 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 wait. I know there are rich guys chasing you. I will marry you. And babe, this has been a long journey. You'll always be my best friend. If we don't fight, who will I fight with? <laughs> Frederick will be shooting, I will call him for minor things. He said, babe, I'm shooting. He said, hey, but what, what do you want me to tell? Thank you for being a brother to me. Thank you for being my best friend. Thank you for being my supporter. Thank you for standing by me. Thank you for not seeing me as um, someone who's not from your tribe, but she's yet, babe. And remember when I met Frederick, he would not marry an Anambra guy, Anambra people don't marry robots. Who tell you? <laughs> but Frederick has stepped to his promise. And babe, in front of the world and everyone that is witnessing today, I want to say that from the belly of my heart from from the deepest deepest of her baby you know i'm not a long talker like you but you know that i love you thank you for planning our finance thank you thank you for making up making sure that we grow together thank you for holding my hands and say babe you are going to make a big mistake don't do this i appreciate you i'll always be a stubborn girl you have to deal with it for the rest of your life. You will always be a stubborn man, and I will deal with it for the rest that's of life, that's my that's life. That's Thank you. But I will never cheat on you. I know that's your biggest fear. I want to say that God has blessed us. You and I know that God has blessed us. And we are grateful to God. He has blessed you. He has blessed me. And I want you to know that I love you. I will always love you, no matter what happens. Ours will be different. Amen. Amen. They say entertainers marriage don't last. We will last. Amen. We will be an inspiration to the younger ones. Amen. We would love each other. We will show people how it is to love one another. We will have the number of kids we want. <laughs> and for everyone that is here to witness our love, thank you. It's been seven years. Seven years now. And Frederick. Leonard, I am now your wife. Yes! I love you and God bless you for me. Amen! Oh. Let's talk. 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 Let's talk.